Louise Thompson has shared a health update after she returned to hospital this week and has revealed she has begun therapy. The former Made in Chelsea star took to her Instagram story to share her latest news with fans after she was admitted to hospital on Thursday night after receiving alarming blood results. After going through a traumatic birth of her first baby where she nearly died twice, she has been left with a string of health issues. Following her latest stint in hospital, Louise posted a photo of her dog and thanked her fans for their support while she goes through the difficult time. She wrote, Thank you so much for your well wishes. So many kind messages and recommendations. I saw a very reassuring doctor last night and am going to start Biologics V soon. Started this morning with a therapy session over in Fitzrovia which was good. Hopefully I'm finally ready to do some good old-fashioned talking therapy. Read more, Louise Thompson asked fans for advice for hellish symptoms before hospital admission. Over the last few days Louise has shared with her followers that she hasn't been feeling herself and has been asking for advice. She recently asked, has anyone with ulcerative colitis or Crohn's experienced worsening symptoms with mental health medication? What worked for you? I never had to medicate at all before all of this hell. Louise also decided to get a blood test done privately due to feeling let down by the NHS. Sharing her results, she said, Anyway, I just got some recent blood test results back that I had to pay for privately and my iron and hemoglobin levels are low which is incredibly triggering. To be honest quite a few of them are either too high or too low which I find incredibly triggering too. Before giving birth Louise said she was extremely healthy but now she can find it difficult to even get up the stairs. After going through a traumatic labor, Louise had to stay in hospital for a month afterwards due to serious complications as she nearly died twice during childbirth. Louise's partner Ryan Libby has also recently opened up about how the situation tends to affect their family as well. He said, just as I thought I was approaching a time period where I could focus some energy into my own therapy and healing, Louise unfortunately still struggles with various things every single day and some of those symptoms are worsening. We're now back at the hospital, this time private as we've been so let down by the NHS, because Louise has received some alarming blood test results. At this moment I don't know how serious this is, but it feels devastating to be sat outside in a hospital waiting room, seven months on from Louise giving birth. He added, I'm holding on by a thread. Trying to work, keep business alive, earn money to support Louise and Leo, trying to keep up with my own ambitions, and failing. It's not like me to share stories like this, but I feel so s at the moment. Maybe this unload will help.